Hi everybody, this is Jim Egan, head of school, Synapse School, with a Friday update. Well, we got the campus open. I'm here, middle schoolers are far in that direction. Uh, we opened on Wednesday, it's now Friday. Uh, what a relief, uh, what uh, an achievement by a whole lot of people working incredibly hard, working in concert, uh, thinking creatively, collaborating to get this uh, hybrid campus start off the ground. I want to thank uh, all the parents who trusted us along the way. Uh, the leadership team, once again, cannot say enough wonderful things about the leadership group, uh, particularly the sprint team and Bob Baer, uh, who uh, really orchestrated the facilities work um, along the way. Uh, I want to thank Stanford for their partnership and um, our task force, right? And in particular, two parents, Pooja Matal and Sarah Cueva, who continue to be incredible resources for us as we open this week. Uh, it has been tremendous. In some ways, it's been anything but normal. And then in other ways, it's business as usual. Kids are here, they're laughing, funny conversations are happening. Teachers are saying, hey, I have this idea in person. And so we are um, seeing a lot of new things and some not new things along the way uh, this week. So it's been tremendous. Uh, it's just been an extension of the learning that's been happening online since the beginning of August. Uh, I want people to understand that too. We have been in school for a while now. It's just the campus open and um, we're deep into our, to our trimester. I was looking at the calendar this week and I was saying, or for the, for the coming week, and I was looking, okay, we have a town hall on Monday night. That's something that just has been going on. Common Ground, the speaker series that Synapse is a part of with the independent schools in the area. Uh, they have uh, an event Tuesday in, uh, on Zoom, uh, seven o'clock about college admissions in the COVID era, right? Common Ground is a part of every year. We have these events for our, for our parents and for our faculty. Um, lower school back to school night was this past week. Middle school back to school night is this coming Wednesday. Uh, and then we are going to go into a fall break. And these are, um, these are normal events for us being done in a different way, but it's just nice to see the cadence of the trimester moving along. Uh, and, uh, and it just feels good. It feels good to be back uh, on campus and it feels good to be back uh, in the swing of things with staff. So uh, that's the update. Please read the newsletter. There's some exciting uh, information in there about uh, another piece in Palo Alto Online that, uh, about, uh, about our um, campus reopening and what we have done to make that happen safely and securely and how we wanna share our knowledge. Uh, there are a lot of other updates uh, from key players, from Katie to Isha to Stephanie. Liz has got things in there around uh, reporting symptoms and testing as well. And so uh, here we are uh, and here we go into the campus learning environment and certainly into the uh, back half of trimester one. Be well, everybody. Uh, be safe. Have a great weekend. Hopefully uh, it's going to be as beautiful as it is now. Okay, take care.